What happens if you need to factory reset your Samsung Galaxy S21 5G? It looks like this with the cool three lenses on the back of this raised panel. And you, you, uh, you've forgotten your pin, so you need to reset your phone. So let me show you how, and it takes a little bit of coordination. So pay close attention, let me show you. So first we, we need to power off the device. So, but you can't power off the device because you go to power it off and it says we need the pin to power off the device. So this is where a little bit of hand-eye coordination fits in. So we need to power off and we're going to hold volume down and power at the same time. And as soon as the screen turns off, we're going to let go and immediately switch to volume up and power. All right, so here we go. I'm going to press the volume down first, power, and this takes anywhere from five seconds it could take up to 30 seconds depending on your phone right there it powered off now I'm gonna grab volume up and power again and then again it's gonna take a few seconds as soon as the Samsung logo shows up let go with both fingers it's gonna take a few more seconds keep holding don't let go there it is vibration and the Samsung logo and then now It'll bring up the Android recovery menu, and we can go to Wipe Data Factory Reset, press OK. One more time, Factory Data Reset, press OK. And we can confirm down here that the data wipe is complete. You can reboot the system. And that is how you factory reset your device if you've forgotten your PIN, and it's not allowing you to power off the device. Hopefully that helps you. And, oh, one, one last thing, if you've set your phone up with your Google or Gmail account, 100%, you're still going to need your Google or Gmail account to log back into the phone. All right, if this has helped you, please like, please subscribe. Thank you for watching.